Perk Defense, Main Line, 4.B3. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Although white played a great end game, black did even better. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The perk defense begins with d6, controlling the e5 square and preparing for nf6. The dark square bishop is made available once d4 completely takes control of the center. nf6 advances the knight and engages in an attack on the exposed e4 pawn. nc3 defends the e4 pawn. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. b3 develops the bishop toward the center and protects the d4 pawn. Games Master It is the final book action. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. It is quite good. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. That's good. A knight is pinned as a result, which limits its movement. That's good. This strikes the opponent's bishop. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. This can indicate that a pawn is being attacked. It is ideal. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is excellent. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. This uses a pawn to attack the center while vying for position. This poses a fork piece threat. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is incorrect. Castling develops a rook, while also getting the king to safety. By castling to the opposite side of the board as the opponent, the game will tend to be more double-edged. It is good. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Backs off. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. This disregards a superior method of strengthening a weak pawn's defense. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. The bishop is now in a secure position. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. This overlooks an opportunity to pin an attacker of a vulnerable pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. This prevents the opponent from being able to kick a knight. It is best. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. This misses a chance to pose a pawn winning threat. This enables the adversary to kick the knight. It is incorrect. There was just one smart move to be made. This is a missed chance to imply that winning a knight is possible. It falls flat. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. This squanders a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. This threatens to fork pieces. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. It is a miss. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This reveals an attack that poses a threat to a queen. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. 
This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. By elevating it to the seventh rank, this poses a threat of activating a rook. White is equal at this point in the end game. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. The pawn is now on a square that is safer. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. A powerful play. It is quite good. This wins a pawn. This is the only good move. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This makes it impossible for the adversary to advance a passed pawn. It is ideal. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is quite good. There was just one smart move to be made. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. It is incorrect. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only good move. It is a great move. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is ideal. In the end game, an active king is essential, and removing it from the rear rank is the first step. It is ideal. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. Thus, the assaulted rook is protected. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Recaptures. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. That's good. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This is the only move that works. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a great move. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. As a result, the adversary may promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. This pushes a passed pawn. This is the only good move. It is best. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is quite good. This move puts the rook on a safer square. This threatens to use a rook to counter a passed pawn. It is excellent. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to use a rook to counter a passed pawn. It is a great move. This is how you take the pawn. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. That's good. This suggests using a rook to block a pawn that has been passed. It is ideal. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to use a rook to counter a passed pawn. It is a great move. This requires an open file, a typical technique for rook activation. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. Though not the best move technically, it was interesting. It is quite good. Backs off. 
It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is ideal. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is quite good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. A passed pawn is pushed by this. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. It is ideal. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is ideal. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. It is ideal. This pushes a passed pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. A wise decision. It is quite good. Placing a rook behind an opponent's passed pawn can inhibit the pawn's ability to promote. This is the only good move. It is a great move. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Although white played a great end game, black did even better. This wins a pawn. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Although white played a great end game, black did even better.